we don't get paid nearly what Joe Torre gets paid, but we'll manage a little bit right now because there are several ways that this could go as you look at Carrasco's numbers. Runners on first and second, nobody out. Aaron, really true. Heads up base running by Bernie there. And Boone Bucks. They have one play. It's at first. They make it. The sacrifice successful. 3-4. So Boone lays down a beauty. That was a, an excellent play. Great technique. Getting the ball nicely. Moves the runners up. And now Joe Tura. But um, I'm sure Susan Waldman will find out in the post game. The Nissan post game immediately following the game. So Ruben Sierra in and the 2 2. He struck him out. Through a slider. Two away. That leaves it up to Soriano, who is 0 for 5 tonight. Rounded deep to third. Batista Field steps on third. And Carrasco works out of trouble. For the Yankees, no runs, no hits, three walks, no errors, and the bases are left loaded. We go to the bottom of the 11th inning here at Camden Yards. It's the Yankees four and the Orioles four. Something he could put in play. Hard. 3-1. We won't. Wow. The leader attempting the butt, you, you know it's going to boil down to you. This time he's swinging, and they have Nick Johnson hung up. The throw to first is in time. The hit and run was on, and Jeter swung through it. So Fordyce made the throw through, and you score two, six, three. Johnson out trying to steal. And the three-two. He struck him out. Fastball low and inside, two away. That might have been ball four. not warming with any urgency. That's if Hammond gets into any trouble. That one's hit deep to center field. Going back, Matos on the track at the wall. See ya! A home run into the center field bleachers for Jason Giambi. And the Yankees lead 5-4. A monster blast by Giambi to give the Yankees the lead. his 35th and the 2-2 strike three inside corner Bernie is down looking well the Yankees have a lead and that lead provided by Jason Giambi one run one hit no errors and nobody left on base his 35th home run of the year for the second time tonight the Yankees will try to close out a win they lead 5-4 last licks for the O's Tonight, the Yankees will try to close out a lead, and this time Jeff Nelson will do the honors. Jeff Nelson comes in, plenty of strikeouts per innings pitched, facing Batista, and then it's going to look like uh, B.J. Serhoff coming out of the dugout to be a pinch hitter. Sterling Hitchcock gave them six innings in an emergency start. That one is lined to left. Right there is Matsui, one away. So Batista hit it right on the screws, but Matsui right there. Oh, he mentioned Batista. The 0-2, strike three inside corner. Serhoff down looking. Nelson one out away from nailing this one down. And that one out will have to come against Jack Puss, pinch. And the 3-2, he walked him. The Orioles are still alive. Drive that's a base hit to right center field. Cust round second. He'll go to third. The ball is cut off in right center. They hold Cust right there. He falls down. The throw.
go to third. They have Kush hung up. He's in a rundown. Nobody covering home plate. Kush falls down. The game is over. Oh, my, what an ending. And the Yankees win 5-4. This had to end like that. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Unbelievable. Not once, but twice. Jack Cust fell down between third and home. Well, we talked about a pinch runner. It might not have been a bad idea. Wow. He's going to have a new nickname, Skates. Wow. Yankees are smart.